Well, tonight, the hunt for these escaped inmates prompted an intense standoff at a Monterey County motel, triggering evacuations and hours of negotiations. But as Night Beats Marie Medina reports, what they found inside that room turned the investigation on its head. At 11.30 this morning, Monterey County Sheriff's deputies surrounded this Motel 6 in Marina after receiving a call from a motel employee who says they'd spotted Jonathan Salazar here. But just minutes before 7 and after an intense night of trying to make contact with the jail escapee, investigators had to admit Salazar slipped away from them once again. We've searched the room and he is not here. After using a flashbang, a canine, and its SWAT team, Monterey County Sheriff's investigators announced they came up empty handed and that 20 year old Jonathan Salazar remained on the run. I'm confident nobody left the motel after we got here. So that time between them calling and us getting here, um, he apparently did leave. This is the hotel room investigators believe Salazar was holed up in. The TV is on and the trash is full. Investigators say they strongly believe he was staying here. We have a strong belief that he was here, okay, from the witness or the person that called and um, interviews that we con conducted. How do you feel about that, that he's not in that room right now? Uh, it's disappointing. I mean, we've been on it for hours and, and people are waiting and we're trying to do everything we can to locate this person along with the other gentleman. On Sunday, investigators say Salazar and Santos Fonseca escaped through a 22 by 8 inch hole made in their ceiling of their cell at the Monterey County Jail. They discovered a blind spot in the corner where officers couldn't see them. Once outside, the inmates discovered barbed wire was missing because of construction, making their escape even easier. Have you addressed the barbed wire that was missing because of the construction that was in place of it? We have. We've put three different levels of security in place. I don't necessarily go into the specific details. Tonight, deputies thought they'd cornered Salazar at this Motel 6, only to find out he was already one step ahead. If both men are watching right now, or if any of their associates are watching, what is the message? Turn yourself in. And investigators don't believe Fonseca and Salazar were together here. Both men face separate gang-related murder charges. On the Night Beat, I'm Maria Medina.